How's it going, folks? Welcome back to the Guild Wars of the Two. Uh, we have to go. Oh, jeez. I don't think we're going to go that way. Oh, get a catapult thrown at me. Nope, let's not go this way. All right, all right. abandon. Abandon. <laughs> Sometimes it seems so simple. Just go in one direction. And then other times, not so much. Anyway, welcome back to Guild Wars 2. We're on to the next part uh, called Wet Work. So the previous episode, Crusader Pasha and I attacked the Crate Slavers in their tower fortress. We defeated the Crate and freed their prisoners, including Warden Highwell. The prisoners told us a Crate Orb with the ability to prevent Zaitar's magic what, from raising the dead and of Lagos, who might have more answers. Apashi and I set out to find this Lagos in order to learn as much as we can about this strange and powerful artifact, secure the Lagos's help to learn more about the Crate Orb. All right, so we are going into the next zone. Mount Maelstrom. Which, from memory, this is actually quite a large zone. And we are going... What is that? Aetherblade Cache. We are going... All the way down here. There's a big event that happens in there. In the volcano. to get through these jungles. Maybe there's an event beginning right now, which leads there. Energy probe. Oh, level 65s. We've been scaled down to 62 for some reason. I oh, know 68. What? Was it 62 five seconds ago? <laughs> and then it just jumped up. Alright, here we are. Wet work. Crusader. Hey, hey, hey. This is tricky. I know the Largos are consummate assassins, but I've never tried to track one. Never even seen one, actually. Of course, very few have. They conceal themselves until ready to strike, and they take pride in efficient kills. <laughs> Taking down dangerous prey to challenge themselves and prove their worth? They'd be right at home in Holbrook. I'd love to hunt alongside a Largo someday, but until then, how do we go about finding this one? By following her trail of kills. Largos are always planning or executing their next kill. Find her latest victims, and we'll find the Largos. The last Largos sighted in the area was to the south, near the magma on the seafloor. How are we going down, are we? I really wish I had my spear gun. Or a spear gun. Any spear gun will do. There's one to remember me by. Although, moves like this, I quite like. And even this one. If it actually does counter. If it does actually attack, rather. To kill rising. Was it a jellyfish? So it waits and waits and waits, does it attack? Too strong. Armored up. It's to kill rising. 
losing. The Lagos is making us safe. Stay near the injured sharks until it comes around again. Oh, jellyfish. Jellyfish was attacking. Stay near the injured sharks. Where is it? Eat my dust. Let's go towards that. Ah, there you are. You're in my way. Leave or you'll be on my list. If you enjoy living, go. Now. Eat my dust! Eat my dust. All right, you have my attention. Speak. You are an interruption. State your business, or become mine. We've come to speak with you about the Crate Slave Master. We need to know about their magical orb that supposedly prevents Orion corruption. You speak plainly and you hide your fear well. Still, your needs don't interest me. And I have no need of you. My people are hunters like yours. We stalk, we wait, we kill. Test us. The commander and I will prove our worth. So, it's a challenge then. Very well. I am currently amusing myself between targets... My current focus is the great sea monster in the caves nearby. Honor the Tetyas Compact. That is the heart of Largos. Track it. Kill it. Bring me proof. Then I will tell you what I know about the crate. If you succeed, I'll find you. What the hell is she? Some sort of weird butterfly? Aquatic? No. Butterfly, definitely a butterfly. Butterfly person. Wearing a, wearing a mask. I guess it's a... So she can breathe. Ooh, look at this thing. I don't like... I don't like my abilities. <laughs> Not a fan of my abilities. Anyway, let's get it. Definitely not a fan of underwater combat. Ninety-five percent. Having to fight vertically. Armored up. Toss it out. Use all your abilities. Turn foes into stone. Nice. 
Done. Impressive. I will present this trophy to the great houses in your names. You have earned the right of introduction. I am Saya Al Rajid. Now, as we agreed, the orb you seek is a thing of legend, known only to deep dwellers. Its origins are lost, but it is extremely powerful. It may pose its own dangers. But it does counter the undead dragon's influence. Wherever the orb is, those who die near it do not rise again. The great are keeping it in constant transit between their largest strongholds to maximize its effect. I suggest a plan. I was brought close to the slave master when I allowed myself to be captured. If you do the same, you may reach the orb. I'd rather snatch it in transit while it's vulnerable. The pack desperately needs to reign in Zaiten's power. We have a difficult decision here, but at least now it can be an informed decision. Thank you for your help, Saye al-Rajid. May your steps be relentless. Shall we talk... above? No, just here. We've got two ways. What? Hang on a sec. Just... <laughs> Let's just... Can we go up top? No, she's not following. Okay. Fine, let's talk underwater. We got two ways to get the orb. I know my choice, but it's your call. Should we allow ourselves to be captured or hit the crate procession in transit? Let's uh, get ourselves captured like Sayer did. I haven't done anything like this before, but we'll manage it. I'll make sure the crate think we're the next victims and meet you north of the crate city. I'll see you there. Right. New stuff, new stuff. No, no, no. Nothing we can use. Salvage it all. Okay, so. Let's go slightly north. Slightly north into the east. Or slightly east into the north. One of these, one of these hotkeys makes something. There it is. What the hell was that? No, death not good. Sunken Drokna. Oh, Drokna. Oh yeah, I know this place. I think Drokna's Forge. I think. Well, that's spelled differently. I think might not be the same place, but there's. Remnants here that look like it could be. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> Why'd you do that? It's all a Surin looking. Must not be in the same place. An Asuran forge? Asuran fortress, rather. Yeah, because... Gauntlet Gulch. It's just this is the path that I would run down in Guild Wars 1. 
I'm sure it goes all the way down here. And there was a place called... Uh, I'm sure it was Drockner's Forge. It's just because it's called Drockner. But it's called Drockner with an N-H... N-A-H, and I think it's Drockner. N-A-R or N-E-R. I could be wrong about all of it, though. That was a long time ago. Although it did say... It did say there was something in the water. Maybe... A, a monument? I'll just go over there and earn that point. Oh, this... See, th it could be Drockner's Forge. I can't even remember if it's called Drockner's Forge. <laughs> but that, that would have been the entrance. I mean, the it does say it's sunk. Yeah, it is the place. This is the place. I would run people down here. For, uh... Can't remember how much I used to charge. Maybe it was 12 platinum or something. Let me go to that hero point. Sorry, this is a bit of a nostalgia for those Guild Wars 1 players. feel like I got some my uh, some armor here that I really liked as well for my warrior Drockner's relic these coral caked fortresses and ruined ships have sunken Drockner's forge there it is in AR Drockner's forge dwarven stronghold and waypoint for the greatest heroes of Terria are haunted by the glory of past ages. Oh, this might be the PvP area. There was a PvP area on the side. Yeah. Interesting. Funny, like I've I mean, been all the years I played Gorosu, I didn't actually know this existed. I <laughs> don't know why. Alright, anyway. Willing captives. Looks like we might be going in there anyway. Ah. Oh. We're ready to go, Commander. The Order of Whispers has already seeded disinformation to lead the crate here. As far as they know, the Inquest set up some troublesome packed soldiers to be sacrificed to the Crate Prophets. It's too much to hope that they'd toss us in the same cell. We need a plan for finding each other once they separate us. We'll also need to grab our weapons as soon as we break out of their cages. Then we can link up to search for the orb. Agreed. If they cage you underwater, look for me high up in the tower, and vice versa. I'll do the same. These slave-taking snakes will believe we're more helpless victims. <laughs> I look forward to giving them a nasty surprise. Get captured by the crate. Here they come. Veteran slaver Nymphasa. Look at my shoes. Here you are, my love. <laughs> Stand perfectly still, and you might live a while longer. Don't struggle now, you pile of limbs. You're coming with us. Ooh, bollard. Still got my weapons, though. You secured the armored female? Of course, and her weapons. You took care of the other one? I did. The beast hungers. In the prophet's name, soon it shall eat. Escape and retrieve weapons? The cage has seen a lot of use. The bars are worn and rusty, but appear sturdy. Examine the bars. Most of the bars are set in place. One, however, has come loose. An application of force would dislodge it. Pry out the loose bar. 
The bar comes off the cage. It is now a suitable weapon. Hard enough for bashing and sharp enough for stabbing. Continue with the escape plan. Bash our way out. What? What'd you call me? <laughs> Get stunned. And you're done? Where's my weapons? Oh, she said she was up there. Oh, here we go. Come here, come here. Get stunned. I said get stunned. There we go. Now let me get my weapons. Now you're in trouble, pal. Oh, actually, not really. <laughs> it's to kill rising. Maybe I was better off with the bar. Get back here, punk. I ain't going nowhere. Attacking pal. Oh, look at him. Run him right through. Shish kebab. It's fried up. Finally, now we need to get above, because I'm sick of using these crappy weapons. Dust. Let's find a patch, yeah. Don't go too far, just swim on the surface. Broke my leg before I could cry out in pain. I was muffled by the water. Hey, you didn't see me shift through the shadows. It's to kill rising. Oh, we must rise. Just wait a second. Oh, what? Why you do that? It's to kill rising. Oh. <laughs> 
Oh, you bastard. You dirty bastard. Yeah. Don't you do that again? Ways the way. Well, this way's away. I see her. The orb will move again soon. That's interesting. Well done. That's it. Break that crate's back. I'd be out by now if not for him. Fear not. Don't let him. Got me. Oh, I better get down here now. Oh, my friends is a bit. He's fading fast. Yep, Fish yep, yep. Off. I just don't want to get knocked down. Yeah, to get some of that hell. Now crack this cage open and let me out. You might want to move to the side, like. Great, stay the orb at the bottom of the cave. Let's start swimming. Into the drink. Well, I'm not going that way. I wouldn't mind jumping, going for a dive, but. Let's go this way. To kill rising. Another one over here. That so I stopped rolling off the edges. That's it's good. Armored up. Strong. that down to the drink we got an orb down here somewhere Somewhere? That must be the beast. Raven's eye. It's an ugly beggar. What are you looking at? I don't like the music. Oh, crap. Rich to kill rising. <laughs> <laughs> 
Now we get some crate with us too. Not a fan, not a fan of spear at all. Armored up. Anyway, let's get the beast. get back up oh, I can't patch you now's not a time for that stealth attack Evas evasion that looks good Down you go. Alright. Beast down. Where's the orb? Eat my dust. Where are you? Damn you, crate. Yeah, I think, like, this weapon's probably great for evasion, you know, staying alive somewhat. But from a DPS thing. But then again, I haven't looked at her for a while. Alright. What's in here? Nothing in here. Welcome back, sweetly. We have a special place for you. Get back! Get back! Oh! oh. They took her away. I've got the orb, though. Come to me. We must discuss. Do not be alarmed. I mean you no harm. I was intrigued by your decision to follow my lead, so I shadowed you. You handled yourselves well, until your partner miscalculated. I realized her recapture wasn't part of your plan, but it was too late. Is she alive? I need to get the orb to Traherne at Fort Trinity right away, but I can't abandon Apatia. You have no choice. The crate overwhelmed her and took her. Among my people, we would say her steps have faltered, and move on. I will deliver the orb for you. I will enjoy visiting Traherne again. I owe him, and Largos always keep our oaths. You should go too. The crate will be back in force. The longer you stay, the more likely you will end up lost, dead, or on a torture rack. That won't help your friend. I'll go. Traherne needs that orb, and I need to be at Fort Trinity. But I will come back for Apatia. I swear it. 